students, good morning to you all. How are you doing? I hope you're fine. Hope you're enjoying your stay at home. And I hope that everything is okay at home. This morning, we want to look at food under our agricultural science. And the class is for those in primary one. Federico, Ite, Sophia, Teresa, and Sarah. Hope you all are fine. All right. Please make sure that your notebook is close to you and your pencils are close to you as we learn this morning. Like I said earlier, we're going to be looking at food. F O O D. Food. F O O D. Food. What do we say foods are? We say foods are items eaten by human and animals to live. Foods are items eaten by human and animals to live. So now what we are trying to say is that food are the things that you as a human eat. Also, it's something that animals can eat in order to do what? To live. Okay? Now, when you wake up in the morning and mommy tells you there is nothing in the house for you to eat and you are so hungry, how do you feel? You feel so sad. Why? Because there is nothing in the house for you to do but eat. And as time goes on, every day mommy keeps telling you there is no food in the house, there is nothing in the house for you to eat. You will see that you will start getting trained. You will start having malnourished nutrition. So it's food that helps human beings and animals to do what? To live. Now let us look at importance of food very fast. Now, importance of food. Importance of food. Now, importance of food, that is why do we eat? Why do you eat? Eat it. Why do you eat? Can you tell me what reason why you eat? Sophia, why do you eat? Now, maybe in the morning you wake up and tell me, we want to eat potatoes. And uh, our fear, the mommy brings you water, bring potatoes for you. After eating, you will be so strong, you will be very happy, you will be so excited and healthy for the day, right? Now let's look at why you eat. The first one is, foods make us grow. Now, as a little child, especially at this your stage, you need to eat food, especially you need to balance your food while eating. I may not be able to give you the balanced diet, how to balance food now, because you will still meet them very soon. Okay? But well, first of all, you need to know what food is all about and also why you need to eat. Okay, the second one is foods give us energy. If you watch, when you come to school and you eat very well in the house, you will be very, very vibrant in school and you will be jumping up and down. If a teacher is been eating, you will be dancing. Why? Because you ate very well, you fed very well. Or when you see maybe Andriana did not eat well and he came to school and maybe you see uh, Federico, he ate big food. You will see that Andriana may be quiet. Why Federico will be what? Energized. Federico will be up. Why? Because Federico fed very, very well. Why Andrea did not eat? Okay? Now the third one is foods keep us healthy. Foods keep us what? Healthy. Your health sometimes can be determined. 
determined or by what you eat. That is the reason why sometimes doctors keep some, some people on diet. They place them on what diet. They tell them what to eat at a particular time. They don't eat anyhow and they don't eat everything they see. Why? Because food, there is a kind of food you need to eat at a particular moment in order to keep you what, healthy. Okay, that is it about the importance of food. We said that the first one is food makes us uh, grow, foods give us energy, foods keep, keep us healthy. Alright, that is the importance of food. Let's look at examples of food. We have so many examples of food, like so many. We cannot mention all. There are many, many of them. Under the six classes of food, we have so many types of food under them. Now, the first one that we have on our list is yam, cocoa yam, plantain, meat, banana, eggs, fish, gari, and beans. Let us take it again. Yam, cocoa yam, plantain, meat, banana, eggs, fish, gari, and beans. Okay? These are the types of, the examples of food that we have on our list for today. Alright students, thank you very, very much for tuning into our YouTube channel and thank you for staying tuned for today's section. Please, I would like to urge you, I would like to advise you to always come around, always check your YouTube channel. Teacher Queen, we always put in new things there for you. Always. Alright? So make sure that you are studying your books. Make sure that you study everything that we teach you on a daily basis. Thank you very much for coming to class with me this morning. Have a nice day.